the tunnel from here game six in this one we'll see the philadelphia 76ers against the new jersey nets this is kevin harlan alongside clark kellogg and mike fratello and we've got david aldridge joining us from the sideline now here's irving five on the clock Malone trying to break free. Another shot. Williams with the block. When Williams gets those long arms up, it's over. Here's Birdsong. This is it to Dawkins. Over Malone. The shot by Dawkins is no good. And that's a strong defensive effort to force the miss, especially against someone of his caliber. And Irving throws it down. Always looking for an opportunity to serve somebody else up. Cheeks loves dropping down. So it's New Jersey now. Philadelphia getting their last shot to go. Birdsong, good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. So many different tricks up his sleeve. Makes him a tough matchup. King against Irving. And there's the pass to Chiefs over Richardson. Here's Irving. Tries yet again. Feeds to Jones over Williams. Jones, no luck. And so just over a minute and a half played. Here's Birdsong. Richardson covered. Shot clock at six. Pulls it from 20. Here's Dawkins. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. What a strong player Dawkins is. Brushing off the physical defense. And it's the 76ers with the ball. Malone sets the pick for Richardson. Pass to Cheeks. Malone against Dawkins. Takes it from 10. Rebound by Williams. Solid defense down low, defending the rim. Over to the left wing. Dawkins, a screen on Irving. Here's Birdsong. Another one falls for New Jersey. And Birdsong is a gifted shooter, especially from the mid-range area. Cheeks with it. With a jumper from the elbow. Hard to pass up a mid range shot like that when you find yourself with that much space. They set the pick. Shoots from the high post. Birdsong. Good. Birdsong's got six. Clearly, he's found his rhythm early in this one. Looking to score whenever he can, whenever he has. It. And this team encourages him to be active on offense because they understand how dangerous he can be. 76ers trailing. Malone, good. For his length, his persistence, his size, Moses was custom made to own the glass. Great offensive play right there. Here's Birdsong. Six points for him. Releases from 15. Here's Williams. That one goes in. It's never easy trying to keep him off the glass. He's an absolute beast down there. Richardson outside. To the paint. Here's Malone. That one dropped for his second bucket. Mark him two for four. A tried and true play for this team. Malone exceptional in the pick and roll. King outside. Pass to Williams. Over Jones. Williams gets the bucket. Williams has got his second bucket tonight. And the 76ers call time here. Both teams will make substitutions. There's a minute 47 left in the first. Oh, the lob to Irving. 
takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. You love the vertical, the bounce, the ability to go up. And then the power combined with that on the flush. Man, Irving making it look easier than it is. Oh, Korn. Rebound by Ivoroni. Not a bad look, just didn't fall. Irving against King. No good from Irving. For New Jersey, they've gone 6 of 9, shooting it well. O'Corn passes to King. Nails the baby hook. Just owning that painted area. I guess the motto is do it till they stop it. 76ers shooting 43% since taking the floor today. And there's the feed to Irving. Shoots over King. And Irving with the basket on the assist from Edwards. Irving's got eight. An accomplished mid-range scorer. I like watching Irving get it done from there. Cook the pass to King. 41 seconds left to play in the first quarter. And Dawkins signs it in. Throw it up and let Chocolate Thunder get it done. For Philadelphia, they've gone 7 of 15 from the field at this point. Here's Irving. The putback. Rebound, New Jersey. They come into this one after losing on Sunday. Their defense was all spread out, not connected, leaving lots of holes, which the offense was able to exploit. They just weren't communicating, weren't hustling. I'm sure it was driving coach up the wall. King, the pass to Dawkins. It's stolen by Johnson. And there's the drive. Passes it to Ivoroni. Here's Edwards. All right, here he goes. And gets it to fall. Clarkie beats the clock. Certainly looks like he got it off just in the nick of time. He knew exactly how much time he had to work with and delivers a huge shot. It's all tied in Philadelphia. We'll take a quick break, then get you back to the action. And here we go, heading back to the action here in the Eastern Conference Finals. And looking at what we've seen from the 76ers, what do you guys think? Their efforts on the glass paid dividends in that first quarter in a big way. Love the intensity they've shown us there, denying their opponents second chances at the cup. Here's O'Corn. Still yet to score. Birdsong misses. Boy, that's a squandered opportunity there. One he'd like to have back for sure. Oh, here's Edwards. Tight defense on him. The pass to Malone. Pocket six. Fades. He gets it in there. Malone's got six. More than just a low post player, Malone can knock down Jays. Cook kicks to Johnson. That's the Birdsong. For Jones. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. Malone's got four rebounds now tonight. Mountains passes to Edwards. On the wing, Malone. From the baseline. And he gets it to go. Malone's got the lead up to four now for the 76ers. And that is textbook perfect. The bounce pass. Exactly how you want to throw it. Johnson, the pass to Jaminski. To the middle. Here's Birdsong. Count that as his fourth basket of the night. Just seven shots to get there. Never breaking focus. The mental game is a huge advantage for Birdsong. Down low. It's intercepted. And now New Jersey on the break. And here they go. Cook the pass to O'Corn. Over Jones. Back to Cook. Six on the shot clock. Here's Jaminski. Excellent dime from Cook. Loves getting his teammates involved. 
quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Outside Edwards. Fountains passes to Malone. Malone is doubled. The 19 foot shot tipped away. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Malone. Not sure who he was looking for there. I know the third row definitely wasn't expecting a pass. Jones checked in for Philadelphia. Sheeks checks in for Jones. The Nets have gone two of four shooting the ball here in the second. Cook the pass to Williams. Pass to Bergson. The second chance effort. Jaminski. Well, it was only a matter of time, but they finally get the bucket. Jaminski's got his second bucket of the night. Cheeks outside. Malone with the screen. Cheeks the pass to Malone. And it's slammed in by Malone. Yeah, Malone showing you the bounce. How high he got up there, dunking comes pretty easy to him. It's quite easy when you get that high up. Here is Cook. No scoring in this one. And there's Williams. That's good on the assist from Cook. And the Nets lead by two. The 76ers have gone three of four from the floor here in the second quarter. Chiefs outside. Passes to Milwaukee. Eight away. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor. So far, Malone has it going on, folks. The defense appearing absolutely helpless trying to stop him. Here's Birdsong. He's got eight. Now the pass to Jaminski. Here's Birdsong. Just five to shoot. Here's Cook. It's hauled in by the 76ers. Malone's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Some changes for Philadelphia. Irving comes in for Moses Malone. And it's Richardson in for Edwards. And it's Jones with the ball for the Philadelphia 76ers. And Philadelphia decides to take their first timeout right here. And so here is Philadelphia. Cheeks outside. Jones against Williams. Cheeks kicks to Irving. Six to shoot. Over Cook. The good looking shot from the wing. Irving's got 10 points. It's a thing of beauty to watch Irving shoot. His stroke is so sick. Cook, the pass to Dawkins. Up top, King. He's covered by Irving. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the 76ers. The most consistent attack on offense so far has been the mid-range jump shot. We'll see if they can keep that rolling. Something else I like, their post play. Getting that ball inside, I love that. The first free throw is good. Johnson, he's checked in for the 76ers. That's good as he hits both of his shots. For Philadelphia, they've gone five of six so far from the field in the second quarter. Cheeks the pass to Irving. He feeds it to Jones. 
Five to shoot. Back to Irving. Shoots over King. Irving can't get it to go. Well, we've seen him make this shot often with no defensive cover. He's got to be kicking himself he didn't make that one. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Here's Birdsong. It's good. With that basket, he's now five for nine. Tremendous confidence from Birdsong. You know, that's why defenses have to be right up into him. Otherwise, it's a wrap. On the wing, Irving. Doesn't go for him. And a close game so far through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Nets lead by two. Stay with us, folks. We'll get back just after halftime to start the third quarter. And we're back. Good to have you with us for 2K Sports coverage of Game 6. An exceptional performance so far from Moses Malone. They've leaned on him throughout the first half. And he's rewarded that trust they have in him. Putting up an impressive total. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. The Nets with the lead. Richardson left side. It's good. Richardson's got it going here in the start of the second half. The first points in the third quarter for the Nets. The 76ers shooting well. 50% from the floor. Pass to Richardson. Wants to get it to Malone and does. Count that as his seventh field goal. Nine tries. He's shooting 78%. Inside, Moses runs into some high effort defense. But he pulls out all the stops to get a shot. For Here's Birdsong. He's got 10. Pass to Dawkins. Williams inside. He's covered by Malone. Using his stature to beat them to the rebound. Love to see a big man doing his thing. Here's Irving. Good for his sixth make in a dozen attempts, shooting 50% with that basket. Even when you contest Irving's shot, he's capable of burning you. This is how gifted a scorer he is. King left side. And it's sent back by Irving. Look out, Irving outworking the shooter and getting a hand on the shot. Oh, the lob to Irving. No good on the shot. For New Jersey, they've gotten just one of their first four shots to fall since coming out of the locker with the break. Out of bounds, Philadelphia takes possession. Here's Cheeks. For the lead. Up again. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Malone's got four points this quarter. Excellent work following the play. And getting there for the tip in. Cheeks against Richardson. in the low block and that one's good. Richardson's got the game tied up here for the Nets. The 76ers have gone three of five to start the second half developing a nice rhythm out there. Here's Malone. Malone is doubled. At the tip. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Malone's got 18 points in the game. Great timing to get that one up and down. It was Clark. Nice hustle to get himself in position to make that terrific play happen. You guys said it. Offensive rebounding takes anticipation and hard work. Now a timeout called by New Jersey.
Richards in the pass to King. Here's Birdsong. Dawkins a screen on Richardson. Birdsong, good. 12 points for him. A scoring guard. Birdsong brings this team serious punch in the backcourt. And the 76ers call time here. I've been really impressed with some of the adjustments Coach has made here in this ballgame. Yeah, as the game has moved along, Coach has done a nice job making the necessary changes. On defense, New Jersey. Cheeks the pass to Malone. And here is Irving. Fader on the way. Rebound by Williams. Williams has got his sixth rebound on the night. And stolen by Malone. Cheeks with it. And it's Richardson picking him up. And stolen by Richardson. It's three on three on the fast break. King against Cheeks. And the Nets making a change here. Cooks checked in. A little under two and a half minutes off the clock now here in the third. Pass to Cheeks. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Mo Cheeks, you know, is as crafty a player as there is in the league. Makes good decisions with the ball just about all the time. And on defense, he can pick you apart. Philadelphia shooting their first free throws of the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Cheeks hits them both. Now King. Second half here. We're just over three and a half minutes into it. Nifty move. And Jones sends it back. Outside Irving. Back to Cheeks. Over Cook. Cheeks' shot is good. Cheeks has got four points in the quarter. For a 6-1 guard, Cheeks is never scared about bringing it inside. He believes in his game. King inside. Malone on him. Malone with the block. Oh, the lob to Irving. Throws down the alley-oop slam. Well, that's one way to extend the lead. And what incredible timing on that play to do just that. Huge momentum building. It's got this team fired up. Now here's King. He kicks it to Cook. And the pass to Dawkins. Back to Cook. Down to five on the shot clock. Good ball movement here by New Jersey. Here's King. That three off target had some space there after the little pump fake. Throws it up high. Slowly but surely. Building out this lead a little more. And the opposition better up their play as well if they want to avoid this getting out of hand. Next trail by eight. It's Richardson on the wing. Covered by Irving. A floater. And it's sent back by Irving. Richardson against Jones. Cheeks outside. Back to Jones. He dishes it to Malone. He gets that one. 
Malone's got the lead up to 10 now for Philadelphia. I like when Malone looks to score, especially when he's operating close to the rim. Pass to King. Seventeen seconds left in the third. So it's New Jersey now, trailing by ten. Now here's King to end the cold streak. A shot that time, not on target. And so it's the Philadelphia 76ers with a 10-point lead. Some breathing room heading into the break. They're feeling very confident, shooting the ball with great efficiency and dictating the pace. Right back after this break. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth and final quarter. The 76ers leading by 10. Edwards passes to Routens. Now here's Malone. Nice move. And Jaminski pulls it down. Nets trail by 10. Pass to Bergeron. To Cook. Here's Birdsaw. Passes it to Cook. Just fine on the clock. Here's Birdsaw. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Birdsong's got it back down to a single digit deficit for the Nets. Outside Edward. New Jersey with the rebound. And usually, you can count on him to convert there. The D did just enough to throw him off. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. Count it good. Hey, this is a rinse and repeat, just like last game. He's had his fingerprints all over this one, looking totally dominant. He realizes his strengths on offense and does a fantastic job playing to them and finding ways to stay on. Here is Edwards, following the bucket by the Nets. And it's out of bounds. Nice touch by Malone. And that pass just got away from him, well off his target. And Philadelphia making a change here. Stewart's checked in. Walker's checked in for the Nets. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. Here's Jaminski. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. Philadelphia leading by six. Routens dishes to Edwards. Malone a screen on Walker. Edwards finds Malone. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Well, Malone will not back away from physicality now. He uses all of that muscle of his to get his shot off despite the contact. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for Philadelphia. You have to like what we've seen from them defensively. They've done well contesting shots and have managed to come away with some blocks. And I love the fact they kept the pressure on, really pushing that ball, running it up the floor. I love seeing that. A team staying aggressive even when they're playing well. He misses the free throw. Out on the floor, Moses Malone is a pretty intimidating presence. Almost seven feet tall with a wide build. He can be a monster down in the paint. And Philadelphia making a change here. Cheeks is checked in. And a change for the Nets. Dawkins checked in. Good on the second free throw. We're about two minutes into the fourth quarter in this one. Here's Birdsong. Edwards defending. 
shoot from 12. Rebound by Ivoroni. Ivoroni's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. Just under two and a half minutes gone here in the final quarter. They set the pick. Here's Birdsong. On the high post, he drills it. Right now, he's their best option. You just got to keep feeding him the ball when he wants it. Yeah, counting on an efficient score could be the path to closing the point gap. To the inside. Very pretty alley of win. And the 76ers lead by seven. Nice finish there to guide it in. Yeah, you know, it doesn't have to be a dunk, does it? Nope. No, sir. As long as it goes in. Now, here's Richardson. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It goes on Moses Malone. And that one falls for Dawkins. Well, I tell you what, the muscle and athleticism of Daryl Dawkins, a.k.a. Chocolate Thunder, impressive. He always goes full throttle in action and words. No let up in his game. That misses, so he splits the free throws. Philadelphia leading by six. Irving passes to Richardson. Can't connect from short range. In transition, here come the Nets. The pass to Williams. Good ball movement here by New Jersey. Dawkins, a screen on Jones. A 17-footer. Dawkins tips it, but no good. 76ers have gone one of five from the field here in the fourth. A lot of misses, just the one mate. Chiefs outside. Pass to Malone. Over Dawkins. Malone's shot good. Malone's got 25 points in the game. As they keep expanding this lead, keep feeding him the ball. He's having a great shooting night, so yeah, I'd say getting him the rock is a great game plan. Now a timeout called by New Jersey. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Hey, guys. Well, Alexi Morris was just going over his plan with his team. He said to his guys, we need to push the pace more. Come on, guys. We're at our best when we're attacking in transition. Energy up now. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. Here's Birdsong. There's the lob to the hoop. Not just a scorer, Birdsong is also adept at finding uncovered teammates. The 76ers leading by six. Richardson outside. 151 left in the fourth quarter. On the wing, Irving. Shot clock at five. Inside. Here's Malone. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Malone's got seven points here in this quarter. Yeah, you know, one thing about being a great scorer, you draw a lot of defensive attention, and there Irving takes advantage by finding an open teammate. Here's Birdsong. Here's King. From 16 feet away, he cans it. You know, that part of the floor, guys, is more or less his real sweet spot, right in his wheelhouse. Pass to Richardson. Now the dish to Malone. And he banks in the layup. Malone's got 29 in the game. So consistent from the field. A quality outing for him. Here's Birdsong. Kicks it out to Richardson. 
Here's the screen. Passes it to King. Wide open look. Again, the Nets for two. A gifted passer. Richardson knows how to create for his guys so well. The 76ers have gone four of eight in this fourth quarter, shooting an even 50% from the field. Here's Malone. And the 76ers tack on two more. And it makes sense why they keep running the offense through him, proving how efficient he is. Now a timeout called by New Jersey. They're trailing by eight. There's 49 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Seconds left to play in the final quarter. Now a timeout called by New Jersey. They're behind by eight. There's 49 seconds left in the fourth quarter. finds Richardson here's Dawkins guarded by Malone and Jones over to help here's Birdsong Richardson cover and again no good by New Jersey the coach for Tello, they just need to take care of the ball right now yeah Kevin just stick to the game plan and ride it out not coasting the victory. They're running through the tape. Run through that finish line. That's how you do it. Keep it going through the checkered flag. Here's King after Moses Malone's score. You know, and to put things simply, they've outworked the opposition on the glass, which is why they have this lead. Yeah, coach has to be really happy with their effort on the board. Just being absolutely relentless and torching the opposition as a result. Cheeks outside. And so the Philadelphia 76ers have won the series. They've got to be excited, but also a little relieved. So much pressure on this team from the media, the fans, and the players themselves. A tremendous opportunity now, just four wins away from a championship. They can see the finish line, but this last hurdle will probably be their greatest test. I'll tell you what, though, winning the Western Conference Championship is a big victory of its own. No matter how this season ends, it's been a successful one for them. And they'll represent the East in a final series that's mere days away. And so this one is in the books. We hope you've enjoyed being with us for the Eastern Conference Finals. For our reporter David Aldridge, along with Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello, this is Kevin Harlan. Thank you for watching tonight's game. So long.